time for Nerdgasm. Hey, what's up guys? Jerry here, AKA Barnacles. And boy, have the boxes been piling up around the Nerd Cave from the numerous deliveries I get. And I thought it'd be cool for us to do another What's in the box? episode and see what all this stuff is. Also, if you guys enjoy my videos, please take a second to hit that like button and also consider subscribing. I have a giveaway of a 3D printer coming up this following weekend at Midwest Rep Rap Festival. It's gonna be awesome. All right, well, to open up these boxes, we're gonna need a little assistance. All right, let's start with this little white one right here. This is from Kyoko Yuki, otherwise known as UZP Customs. Now, I've seen this person blowing up my Twitter waiting for this to get opened. Oh, bat knife. No, 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 bat knife. Bat knife. Hey guys, if you're wondering what my P.O. box is and you want to send me stuff, just check the video description. The video descriptions on all my videos contains tons of information, questions and answers, all kinds of cool stuff. Make sure you check it out. All right, what do we got here? We have a box, a smaller box inside a bigger box. Yeah, okay. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh, it's a mug. I can tell that far. It's a mug, guys. I can tell that much. All right, here we go. You guys ready for it? Let's see what it says. That is an awesome cup. Nerds rule. Oh, what is this? Oh, what a troll. <laughs> yes, I will be putting this on something. Nice troll, UZP. All right, let's get the big boy out of the way here. Oh, this is a big old box right here. No, 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 bat knife. No, 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 bat knife. Hey, fun fact. I just sharpened bat knife a couple of days ago because an anonymous one of you guys actually sent me a knife sharpener. QNAP, secure data backup. Come on out of the box. Out of the box. Come on, poop it on my desk. Poop it on my desk. Mm. So that appears to be a QNAP TVS873. Now I have been expecting this. Uh, QNAP did give me the heads up that they were sending this to me because they wanted me to review it after seeing me review the Synology uh, NAS solution. So this will be pretty cool. All right, should we see what's in the little box? Is this even worthy of bat knife? Nah. All right, it's a little baggy. Little anti static bag. Here, here we get one more nah. Nah. This would appear to be a Kingston 250 gigabyte M2 SSD. And I'm going to go ahead and guess that this is for the caching drive on the QNAP. I'm going to go ahead and put that back in this box, though, because I don't want it to get damaged, because that is pretty fragile. All right, let's see what's in this one. Bat knife cuts way better when it's sharp. I will give you guys that. All right, we got some. Oh, look at that. Uh, that would be filters for my cube water filtration system. This is actually uh, what I use in the kitchen so that the water that comes out of the tap doesn't taste all nasty. It actually works pretty good. I don't know if I'd recommend cube to anybody. Uh, it's really expensive and honestly, there's cheaper, better solutions, but uh, I already got it installed. So I figured what the hell, get some more filters for it. Alrighty, we have, it looks like a reused Echo Amazon box. All right. And this one comes from Anna Kerr. <laughs> Oh, whoa, check this out. Oh, Anna from Circuits and Coffee. Yeah, no, this is actually a really, really cool person. You should check her out, Circuits and Coffee on YouTube. She actually sent some Nintendo stuff. Check this out for, uh, for Xander Man. Wow, there's a bunch of them in here. So there's, uh, looks like we got Mario here. We have Bowser and we have Luigi. And they look like they're like, uh, designed to connect up to a track that she already gave me earlier. So I can see she's building on this theme. This is nice. Thank you, Anna. And uh, yeah, Xander absolutely loves Mario. It's like his favorite thing on planet Earth. So he is gonna be so happy to receive these. Thank you so much. Go ahead and just lean all those up against the screen. There we go. All right. Next box. All right, let's try this little white guy right here. All right, this is from Sense Labs. All right. No, no, bat knife. No, 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 bat knife. Uh. Damn, there's a lot of tape on this box, 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 box. Seriously? Ah, ah. Hull grip. Jeez. It's a box in a box. Out of the way, box. All right, sense. Understand what every appliance, light, and device in your home has to say, know what's up, see what's up. Okay, so this right here is another thing I've been expecting from a company that uh, makes this product sense. It actually ties into your electrical system through your box in your garage, and it learns the electrical poles of all your appliances and everything, and then it can break it down 
and show you uh, what's on, what's off, what's in use, what's using power, everything like that. It's supposed to work pretty good. So I have to have an electrician install this though. So I'm gonna set that up when I get back from my trip. But you guys can expect a review of that. All right, what have we here? This is a box, a heavy box actually. This, this one's got some girth to it. Let's see what's inside. Bat knife, bat knife, roly poly bat knife. Bat knife, bat knife. Eat them up, yum. All right, what do we have in here? Oh, this looks like hard drives. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh, don't sue me, whoever owns Halo now. Whoa, this is actually a really cool packing job. All right, what do we have here? This would be four hard drives. These appear to be uh, six terabyte Seagate Iron Wolf drives. You guys can see that. These are for the uh, NAS solution here. Uh, so there we got four of those. And I'm just gonna hazard a bet, since this box weighs exactly the same, that it probably contains four more drives. You guys wanna bet? Now obviously this NAS solution isn't gonna compete with old Linus Tech Tips and his Gigormous one, but you know what, I'm just a little guy. I'm just a little guy, I'm making my way, you know? I'm making my way. All right, so what do we have here? It looks like we have, uh, one of the drives tried to escape the packaging. These are eight terabyte Iron Wolf drives. So I have four eight terabytes and four six terabytes, it looks like. So it's interesting that they didn't send me all the same drive. So I'll probably break these up into two separate arrays, but that's totally fine. So that's a lot of storage, holy crap. So that's 32 terabytes right there. And these are six, so six, 12, 18, 24, 28, 36, math, math. You guys can figure it out. I got four six terabyte drives and four eight terabyte drives. Give me the total. And if you're really nerdy, give me the formatted total with a 64 kilobit block size on an NTFS format. Well, now I can have the entire internet's porn collection cached on my NAS. All right, let's see what's next. We have this box here coming from the Amazon Fulfillment Center. So this is probably something off my wish list, I'm guessing. This package refuses bat knife. Sorta, I didn't make it all the way. Wow, sharp bat knife actually works good. Okay, what do we have here? Ooh, look at it, it's a little Christmas time baggy. Look at that. All right, let's see what the card says. The card says, Dear Xander, of course this is for Xander. We really enjoyed your Nintendo Switch unboxing. You are very talented, just like your dad. Aw, please enjoy this early birthday, disc, birthday gift. You are one cool dude from Brian and Erica Fagioli. Nice. All right, let's see what we got in here, guys. All right. Open her up, open up the sphincter bag. What do we have? Oh, look at that, he's been wanting this. That is one, two switch for the Nintendo Switch. Oh my God, Xander is gonna be so happy, except for this couldn't arrived at a worse time because I just grounded him and he's not allowed to play his video games for one week, but I might take this with me to Chicago and just, you know, you know, learn, learn how to play it a little. So is it okay, Brian? Let me know in the comments. Whee! All right, next box. Oh, this looks like it's an old recycled Newegg box. Um, it was actually sent from Next Gen Computers. Okay. Let's see, what is Next Gen Computers sending me here? Oh, did I just forget to sing the Bat Knife song? Sharp Knife. Sharp Knife cutting through boxes. I wonder what my garbage people think when they roll up on my house like every garbage day and there's like 50,000 pounds of cardboard out on the curb. They probably think I'm like a drug dealer or something. Oh, I know what this is. I know what this is. Next Gen Computers. This is this would be Travis Jank sent me this. Check this out, guys. <laughs> How cool is that? Oh my gosh. He uh, posted on Facebook a little while ago that he found this and he wanted to just give it to somebody. And I said, I'll take it. And he's not local to me. So he actually paid to ship this to me. And this is a gaming arcade stick right here. This is going to be fun because you guys know I'm going to be getting into emulators again. And so when I saw this, I, I had to have it. So Travis, thank you. Thank you so much. And also a shout out to Next Gen and Nerdy Ninjas. Compatible with PC, PS3, 13 buttons, USB connector, three meter cable, and turbo function. Hell yeah. And Xander got some new stickers for his door. We got the boxes that appear to already be open. Well, let's see what's inside anyways. All right, this is from, uh, this is a pluggable mechanical keyboard right there. Check that out. This is actually a company that was local to me that actually asked if they could send some stuff. Um, but yeah, this is a mechanical keyboard. It's actually a pretty clean looking keyboard. I'll check it out. But they sent some other stuff too that I wasn't expecting. Let's see what we got here. Uh, looks like we've got a USB condenser microphone. That's kind of cool. It actually looks almost identical to the Audio-Technica AT2050 or 2020. It looks like we have 
a pluggable magnifying glass. Look at that, dude. That's like a digital magnifying glass. Oh, Xander's going to get a kick out of that. Looks like it can also connect up to a tablet. That's cool. Oh, and hey, this couldn't have come at a better time. Flexible Bluetooth headset. Look at that. I'm actually going on a trip uh, tomorrow, a very long trip, so uh, I'll get a chance to try these out on the way. Thank you, Pluggable. I'm going to check all that stuff out, and I will get back to you. All right, and the last and final box that's also open because my wife keeps thinking that she's getting stuff and my name and opens the boxes, but that's okay. I still love her. All right, see what we got here. Ugh. Ooh, that would be a Cooter Master. I see a Cooter Master logo. All right. Ugh. Yeah, son. Jerry, hope you love our Master Key Pro LRGB. Looking forward to seeing how you put it to use. Nice. So this is an RGB keyboard, but more specifically, it is a programmable RGB keyboard. So my goal is to use this to write some programs with some code gasms to actually use the LEDs on this keyboard for useful things. I don't want to give away any more than that, but, uh, but they seem to think that their SDK is a lot stronger than some of the competitor stuff that I've used. So we'll, uh, we'll give them a shot. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this unboxing video. If you did, please slap a like on the video. Also consider subscribing. I have a giveaway for a 3D printer coming up this weekend that I'm gonna unveil at the Midwest Rep Rap Festival. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm also getting into a lot more 3D printing stuff, maker stuff, uh, bringing Codegasm back here shortly. It's, we're gonna have a lot of fun, guys. And all the stuff that you see here, there's probably gonna be some reviews or, or you're gonna see it somewhere. So if any of this interests you, just keep an eye on the channel. Also, if you guys would like to send me anything for the channel, to see it unboxed here on the channel, send it to P.O. Box 279, Duval, Washington, 98019. It's also down in the video description. I love each and every one of you guys. Thank you for all the support. The channel's been doing amazing lately, and I've been feeling a lot better, as you can probably tell watching this video. All right, now get back to watching your, your cat pictures or porn or whatever it was you were doing before you stumbled on my video.